Yay! It's my most loyal viewer, Mr. Rat Super. Yo dudes, eat and the human, <laughs> what's up? And yes, a red super you wear first this time. You did well, you did very well. Lord Calamity. Thanks for watching. Uh, I haven't really decided yet what I'm going to draw, so I think I'll continue with this uh, Rekka move. Yeah, I'm not sure about the launching kick yet at the end. The Jackie Chan punches, most likely, yeah, they will. I will keep these. Maybe he'll do a big backhand uppercut or something. Or a gut punch, I don't know. As long as he will end up in the crane pose. And then he can do either this kick or the, the, the ball blast, the kung fu ball. So yeah, let's, uh, let's do some Jackie Chan. Gato, Gato, Mark of the Wolves. I haven't really thought this out too much yet, but I've always kind of had something like this in mind. Uh, let's stick one out of frame for size reference. Yeah. Yeah, thanks, man. Gonna be pretty cool. Let's do a uh, blobs. Or maybe I can use reuse some parts. Yeah, I don't like to do that too often. Let's see if anything comes close. Probably. It's well belongs. Well, if if only for the size reference. Let's put it in there. Yeah, I might totally be able to reuse these legs. Professor W. Thanks for watching that. Uh, yeah, Solar Flare. Uh, I don't know yet if we're going to give him that. Because Chao Tzu will already get a stunning move. I don't I think he needs two moves that they that they practically do the same. He, no, he kinda moves forward here. Well, you know what, let's just use this these legs as a base, but I'm going to raise them up a little bit more.
what other characters after Tien? Well, I don't know yet. This one is still a long way from being finished. Of course, I do have uh, Bulma, which I sometimes work on. Yeah, that's my uh, my deviant art kind of indeed. Let's just move this out of, out of the way. Extend these feet a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Another follow. It's Professor W. <laughs> yeah, Mr. Five Red Super uh, will be able to tell you a lot. It's my loyal follower. It can be hard to catch me. It's, it's very early for me though. I've got a free day of work, so I literally woke up and went to the bathroom and started streaming. I didn't even eat, eat breakfast yet. You guys be nice to me, right? Ranger W59, what's up? So yeah, it's, uh, it's not even 9 o'clock yet, it's 9 in the morning. <coughs> Alright, this torso is obviously too long. Let's just uh, go over a sheet again. Spreadsheet, see what, he, what he's got. That's the fun part of having a large spreadsheet, which obviously takes a long time before you get there. And then you can start reusing parts. No, don't like that. Don't. Maybe this. Yeah, <laughs> thanks, man. Spread the word. Let's keep that Patreon growing. Maybe if I rotate this uh, lower arm down, it will look similar to that. Njovico! Hey dude. <laughs> I, haven't, I haven't assigned anything yet, anyone yet to be a mother. Maybe if I... Uh, channel grows a bit more, I might need one to keep uh, some idiots in check. <laughs> oh man, I'm going to school soon. You don't need that dude, just stay here all day. Don't want to end up like me. All right, let's grab one more arm. Yeah, it looks like crap right now. No, I don't know. I don't know. Let's just. Uh, Yeah, I'm gonna draw over it anyway. Well, this is already pretty much what I would end up if I did the blobs. But yeah, I think I can just trace it. 
Yeah, whatever. This is just uh, temporary. And then the arm guard here. Well, he's not going to be pointing with his fingers. It should be more like a strike. We'll we get some bulb strike. Yeah, let's do a bulb. Oops, I uh, don't want that. Yeah, Mr. Woozy Whippet. Good teams. Yeah, as I've said before, uh, I can't really uh, play too much music here because of the copyright nonsense. I wouldn't want uh, parts of my my video to be muted. It's not a problem for you guys right now, because you will hear it anyway, but for anyone who uh, watches the video back, I'm gonna have muted parts if I, if I use the licensed music. Yeah, you all need to uh, make some more money.
Hey, buddy. Yeah, I see ya.
Yo, what's up, dudes? And we got the proto man. Yeah, sorry, I have to, I have to get off the mic for a little bit. Snake weight thing that the with the with the whippet made. Mm. Yeah, I'm really not liking how this is turning out. This part at least. I'm pretty sure I'm just gonna s remove these and uh, make some other moves for this second to wrap up part. Yeah, fuck it. Safe change is new. I've had it with this move. So let's uh, just find something else. Um. No, I never did uh, these punches. I don't know if I got anything. Oh yeah, here we go. I could work on the run, run cycle. Something he uh, desperately needs. I don't know if I'm really uh, moody, I don't know, I'm just uh, still waking up. I've never been really that moody, right? my sheet as already but I guess not. So like Piccolo is uh, Piccolo's run, his upper body is just gonna pretty much remain the same. <coughs> and just just the legs are going to move. Oh, it's not going to be static as torso, but generally it will remain the same, and it will remain the same for the for the loop. <laughs> so when the first leg goes up, and then the other, you know what I mean. Don't need that. Yeah, I'm not going to go into the whole uh, fighters discussion. Who knows if they uh, looked at our game? I don't really mind. It's cool. It's a pretty cool game we're getting. Yeah, I'm not 
I think at least. Uh, yeah, this can go too. They look a little bigger, don't they? Familiar questions. No offense, but uh, those questions get asked so many damn times. Probably up to, uh, I don't know, 200 times so far. <laughs> people have asked me that question. How many pet people, yeah, how many characters will end up in the finished game? Well, we're not making a game on a planning. It's not going to be a finished game at any time. It's just a little fan project we're work working on. When we're tired of it, that's where it stops. So basically, whenever, every time someone asks that, that question, we're, we're stopping one year sooner. We're like, fuck it. Make your own characters. No, we don't think that. Uh, yeah, fair question though. <laughs> if you're unaware of the, the game, what it's like. And the guys behind it. Yes, I did. Let's take a look. And there we go. That's the sure about it. Nah, don't be sorry. It's a very common question for, for, for new guys. I'm just messing around a little bit. I don't know, I just, I don't play games at all that much, but I've got some favorites, all old games of course, um, River City Ransom for the Nintendo first one, the NES, that's really, really, really fun, beating guys up, picking them up, throwing them against the wall or against each other. Making a, a human totem pole. 
You know, when you pick some, when you pick a guy up, it's already carrying another guy. That's how you make a human, human to the pole. Everyone. <laughs> uh, well, and another for me is Crash Bandicoot 2. It's a really nice game. I like that. And Mega Man Legends 1. I don't know if it's really a great game, it's just nostalgic for me. Really liked that when I played that back in the days. Crash Bandicoot 3 is. Uh, I don't know. It's not bad, but. It has some of the, the best platforming levels, but it has way too many <coughs> of those mini games. I'm flying in the plane, I'm on the jet ski, on the motorcycle. Way too many of those. So that, by result, you end up with uh, way less platforming levels in total. But the ones that are in the game are uh, really good. Budokai 1, 2, 3, Infinite Worlds, I played those, and that's, uh, that's the last ones for me. I never played one Raging Blast or Budokai Tenkaichi, or any of those games. It just didn't interest me at all. They really just looked like button mashers to me. The only one I played was um, Burst Limits, and I did like that for the little time I did play it, and then and then it owned it. Yeah, didn't like how we got Tenkaichi Budokai and not uh, Burst Limit Two or something. Good luck, Professor W. The yeah, Legacy of Goku 2 was uh, pretty nice, I like that. Part 3 was alright too, but it was, uh, was too easy. It was really challenging. From Right at, from right at, I don't recall at least. Would have liked um, a sequel to that or something. I guess Attack of the Saints was kind of in the same vein as those games. Not really. to uh, link that trailer address. That sounds interesting.
Wasn't there someone else who was making a Dragon Ball version of that game type? It's kind of hard for me to keep track of that. Hidden video. I'm not sure you were allowed to link that. I will, yeah, I'll uh, watch it later, of course. Not midstream. This is the first time I did stop working on a move. Those Jackie Chan punches. They really didn't look like how those came out. Well, at least now I'm finally working on the, the run, which he really needs. Yeah, this kind of sucks, of course, but there will be frames in between, and the upper body will move a little bit. So it won't be too bad. a quick look without uh, without sound. Yeah, that could be uh, could be nice. Could be promising. I would always like a game like that, but with better graphics, or at least yeah, they're kind of cute, but. Uh, higher resolution graphics I mean. But yeah, you can't really use two large sprites for a game like that because it's mostly about the backgrounds. You need to see most of that. I rock. <laughs> well, thanks. I don't hear that too often. Well, online I do, but not in real life. Let's just say uh, this was a uh, real life one. Yeah, this is uh, fine. And again, the, these frames don't come after one another right away. There will be some in between soon won't look as bad with the exact same upper body reduced. for some good uh, animations huh? yeah, I 
don't know what I what else I can do here. Just a bit more lights, I guess. There we go, that's his uh, run cycle. No, it's not, <laughs> of course. other one while we're at it so uh, I can scale them at the same time Oops. Alright, so roughly it's going to look like that, <laughs> but obviously that's uh, nowhere near done. You guys uh, are still almost going to bed, right? I think. At least the uh, US based guys. No, not you. Don't you need to sleep then? Sleep is for the weak or people who work hard or uh, just <laughs> can't wake up for that long. I know, I know I'm pretty tired usually because of my stupid part time job. So, uh, again, support me, donate. Need a lot more Patreons than 
when I do it. Then uh, quit my part-time job. I don't have to wake up in the middle of the night anymore to get there. I would prefer that, of course, just being able to do this stuff all day, working on the the game. Yeah, the part-time job really tires me out. Well, it's not uh, that it's um, far away, I don't have to travel that far, but I just start that early. Four thirty in the morning, usually. Nope. Does need his legs. Yeah, it's uh, pretty damn early. And I do get home about uh, early afternoon. So uh, I, w I am able to do a lot of uh, work, I mean, spreading in the afternoon and evening. But yeah, Sometime, usually I just go uh, take a nap in the afternoon because I'm just that tired. Maybe I wouldn't be as tired if I went to bed earlier, you know, the evening before work, uh, but I just can't. I can't really fall asleep before 11 o'clock in the evening. I tried a few times though, like going to bed at, uh, I don't know, 8 or 9. So I'll, just, I'll just be lying in bed for 3 hours or something. Awake, <laughs> trying to get to sleep, <laughs> and that really sucks. 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 Doesn't really work. Uh, give that torso to the other legs. No, that's some better colors. <coughs> when I was streaming, 2 a.m. Yeah, for me that must have been middle of the night or something. Yeah, Super Boo, really close. going to have another frame, probably, so it's 6 frames in total. Cheerio 2! Yo, thanks man. Right, that frame was uh, good enough for me. Guess again, finish at least this torso. Or maybe I'll try doing the 6th frame. Oh, when I started today, yeah. Yeah, for me it was uh, a little bit before 9. <coughs> 9 in the morning. Penis head, yeah, a little bit. That's alright. Nothing wrong with that. There. <laughs> yeah, let's do a quick version of... Uh, so uh, the extra frame, probably going to hunch down a little bit more. Hey, <laughs> sharing off on Patreon. That's uh, good work, man. <laughs> I'm getting close to 300 
Well, keep them on now. I've been there before, but you know, then the guys have to cancel their uh, their pledges for for reasons. You know, if someone who is donating thirty dollars per month, if, if that one drops, you no, know, then it's a big decline in one you know in one blow. So I really would like. Uh, Bizarre Hermit is now following me. I like that. Yeah, like I said before, I would love if people would donate just one dollar. Just one dollar, that's twelve dollars a year. You can't say uh, that's a lot of money. And then just get a lot of people doing that. Just the one dollar per month. And for me, that, that would add up over time. What should be one of his pellets? The these frames? This pellet. Yeah. That's very possible. We'll let uh, we'll let other people take care of that because they like to do that. We haven't made a, a public pellet template for him yet, for Tian, but uh, yeah, I think we will soon. We already made all the reference pellets ourselves. Well, references to appearances of Tian in Dragon Ball manga anime. But yeah, not really references to other characters. I don't know if you can edit messages, but just uh, there we go. Yeah, right now it's uh, it's still way below what I make with my uh, part-time job. That's about uh, 700 euros per month, and with my Patreon, Patreon, it's only it's not even up to 300 dollars yet, so. There's no way I can uh, quit my part-time job at this point. I really need the income from that. Uh, what am I doing? Kind of lost track. What's the missing frame going to be like? Probably Lee. Leading off these legs probably yeah I'll just have to switch these torsos around get rid of that must look very messy but when you've been doing this for a while it's kind of natural you know you know what you what you're going to get all right that's not uh, the way his leg should be going <laughs> Get rid of that entirely. No, I guess it should be going for it. Maybe just even more. 
Uh, maybe I'll have to end up doing 8 frames in total. That's how much Piccolo's run cycle is. At least that's it. Yeah, Light Struck to know if I can trust you. <laughs> I'll keep it in mind, man. Well, you'll have to remind me because that's the stuff I, I will be forgetting. Go tanks, yeah. Uh, two to three months or four months, I don't know. It's probably going to end up six or seven months. He does. Go tanks. He does have a Gogeta pellet. Well, not a skin, but the uh, yeah, the pellet. I think I can even show that off uh, once I'm done. I'll play a little bit of hyper, I guess. <laughs> yeah, here, here already has it, that pallet. And it, yeah, it works r r really well, of course. Yeah, that's alright. Now do the same. Uh, for these legs. You play it at school? Ooh. That's... that's bad. No, <laughs> that's great. So you should be able to uh, spread it out to a lot of people, getting a lot of interests. That's what we need, just more exposure, more people know getting to know about the game. School sucks, you should play Hyper Dragon Ball Z instead. <laughs> An anime club, but it sucked. No, oh, that's too bad. Kind of, yeah, well, in theory, usually that sounds pretty good, an anime club, but you do end up with a lot of weird weirdos. <laughs> I mean, I'm not going to lie, I will admit I'm a weirdo myself, but I'm so very antisocial. <laughs> I wouldn't be near anyone near a club like that, I think. Because I, I will get extremely annoyed at people like that. You're so uh, out there and busy. I don't like a lot of noise and screaming. Yeah, Maximilian's exposure was uh, great, that was a really nice boost. And hopefully we'll be able to, uh, to keep Max in the loop in regards to this game. He does seem to enjoy it a lot. That works alright, I think. Yeah, I don't mind a little bulge here. <laughs> My little pony Mugen. That's the best Mugen game out there. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not going to say anything about those kind of people. No, it's uh, it's up to you. Mm, yeah, I like 
just enough to keep working on it. Yeah, he will, most likely. That would be nice. Yeah, and I think what we're doing now, releasing the characters one by one, that's better than uh, releasing a big pack with two, with two or three new characters. Because you'll have uh, less time in between new releases. And the releases are still of course the best part about uh, this game it will, it will always get the, the most hype built and uh, you know, the most boosts and new, new interests so the more releases we, we do the better for us Uh, Vegito or Gogeta? Yeah, I don't think so. Vegito would be cool, but yeah, I don't think we're going to do him anytime soon. He's very cool, but there's more interesting characters. And we already have uh, Goku and Super Saiyan Goku. They'll just be a little too similar. And now we've got Gotenks as well. So uh, I don't think there will be any Saiyans new characters anytime soon Piccolo, um, I can't remember. Seems likely though that he made the character of the year. Character of the month? Yeah, character of the year. I've got the banners right here. Yep, yep, that, that's also a reason by the way. Well, that's not really our main reason, but uh, it's just a nice little bonus. Because if we would release uh, two or three characters at the same time, new ones, then uh, the character of the year, or the character of the month, will have to uh, be between those. <laughs> <coughs> so we would probably win one anyway, but you, know, you can't win all three of them. Oh yeah, that's right. Um, I don't know, maybe Gotenks will be finished by that time. What was December of this year? I don't know, his ghosts are pretty complicated. But then again, those are already coded, mostly. Yeah, so... Super Boo is pretty much released. Well, he's not, but he will be very soon. And, uh, it's about four more months of this year. Yeah, maybe Gotenks will be finished at the end of this year. I hope so. Then it will finally be uh, Daron's first big character release. Gotenks has been in development 
very long now. <laughs> About two years. But remember, uh, this development was put on hold for a long time. Pretty much when uh, Just No Point started to take over Piccolo. Then, yeah, it pretty much meant that Gotenks was put on hold. Until Piccolo was finished, pretty much. So. So now that Piccolo is finished completely, uh, Just No Point is, has uh, picked up Gotenks again. Yeah, pretty much uh, every every release is pretty much uh, almost a guaranteed character of the month. <laughs> Of course, a lot of it is because of popularity, but yeah, you get popular for a reason. Because the quality is pretty well known at this point. And I'm sure I'm not going to lie. If it is, if it wasn't Dragon Ball characters, then it might not have been as popular as it is now. But it is, so uh, yay. One, two, three. Four fingers dead, that's correct. And the thumb here. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Farmer, Farmer didn't get the uh, <laughs> character of the month. Oh, I didn't see anything for Mr. Satan, but maybe I just forgot to put the banner on his page. I'm pretty sure he won. Piccolo, yeah. Babidi, I'm not sure. I'll have to check. Let me check real fast if I can see if Mr. Satan won anything. I'm not sure where to look. Right. There we go. When was Mr. Satan released? It must have been April, right? April. What year is it this year? Oh, I see. It's just uh, way behind. The last character that has an, uh, an award is from February. Oh, they're really uh, they're slacking off. On the Mutant Fighters Guild. Hmm. Sorry, I'm just looking into this. April voting. Oh uh, yeah, I see Mr. Satan won. He won by a landslide. But they just forgot to make a cool portrait for him. Oh, you were already l searching for it. <laughs> I was at the same time. Uh, 
I'll have to uh, slap someone to make a portrait for him. I don't know about Babidiel to uh, go back more. Well, maybe Lightstruck, maybe you can look at that up as well. Babidi, Babidi, Babidi. When, 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 when was he released? Ah, it doesn't say. Yeah, first page. Release updates. Uh, 28th May 2015. Yeah, if you can look that up for me, that will, that will be nice. Ooh. Scalpy! Thanks, dude. Alright, let's uh, carry on here. Ayo. Scalpy working on the the running animation of Fortian since he just joined us. Hey <laughs> Yeah, more love for the picture. <laughs> He's going to say uh, he's another student and doesn't have any money. How long am I going to stream for? Uh, I don't know. It's been about an hour now. I'm not really hungry yet and I'm home all alone so... Pretty much as long as I can bear. At least another uh, hour or so I think. Until I get bored. I don't see Babidi in there. Oh my lord. Well, <laughs> I know because of the notification, of course. Otherwise, I wouldn't know any of the new guys. He wasn't even nominated to Babidi. Oh, man. At least the nomination would have been nice. Probably why you guys in Discord hate him so much. <laughs> that's uh, that's the general thought, right? I met Majin Vegeta's thoughts. Another say he's uh, overpowered because of his dashing elbow.
yeah, we're still going to uh, try to balance those characters a little bit. But right now, uh, well, X, X Gargoyle is in charge of the Vegeta brothers. But of course, now he's been busy uh, on the Super Boo all this time. <laughs> and uh, yeah, Super Boo should be done now. Pretty much, the next Gargoyle is uh, is on vacation now. But probably, once he gets back, he will be showered with uh, feedback from new bug reports. Just, you know, stuff that just pops up once a character is released. So, there will be uh, bug fixing and balancing pretty much for uh, the next two months. I think that's how it was for the other characters as well. At least for Piccolo, I know that. Well, yeah, Car uh, Piccolo was the first character that was released once we joined the <coughs> the Discord channel, and that was uh, really an amazing help. But a lot of uh, feedback there, people testing him out, testing him out. Someone asked about Goo again. No? I don't think so. <laughs> no. So once uh, Super Boo is released, then you guys will all have to come to uh, the Bugan Fire Arts Guild and uh, vote for him, of course. But still, I think it's a <laughs> slim chance that he won't win. Ah, I didn't have to <laughs> summon a new layer anyway. Oh no, it wasn't the Apple Garden was separate. I can just try to remove that. Um, yeah, pretty much. Yeah, that's probably going to be it. The Neo Kiko hole. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's going to be it, yeah. But uh, you know, we gotta keep our secrets a little bit. <laughs> yeah, four witches. We're going to have that. For I think both, uh, both a throw, a special move. And uh, super, super is the pretty much the machine gun. Rapid punches. <laughs> Try beam against cell. Yeah, that's it's pretty much the the what what did we call it? The Neo Pico. That, yeah, that's pretty much it. The <coughs> Dodon Ray. You've seen that by now. He's going to get the level 2 version of that. Just a bigger, bigger beam. And big explosion on impact. Yeah. 
Japanese names are better. They are better. Why well, wouldn't get Babidi get Nova made it? He's amazing. No, people hate him. <laughs> Yeah, it will be nice if we could redo him just like we did with Mr. Satan, but uh, I don't know. It's a bit unlikely. That's a lot of work and I don't know if people would uh, care for it that much. For Mr. Satan it was definitely worth it, I think. Because he was literally made in just 10 days, his first version. As, a, as an April Fool's joke. Just 10 days. And the new version was made in a, a year and a half. <laughs> so that's quite a big difference. So yeah, you see, even, yeah, we were, I would say, talented back then, but we only had 10 days before it was uh, April 1st. So yeah, still with talent, you can't make something great if you limit it on time. Pretty much. Yeah, the farmer is very much a joke character, even more so than the first Mr. Satan was. And if he's, of course, he's not even meant to be a, a serious addition to your roster. I think he was made in uh, yeah, just three days, I think. Well, Cybermen are already in the game at the, the moment. But I wouldn't blame people for not including them or taking them out. It can be pretty annoying. <laughs> and of course they're totally useless in a tournament setting. So they will have to be removed there. You can't really control them, uh, you kinda can. You can't really uh, control their movements. But you can press buttons to make uh, a new one appear. Once, uh, once they can, of course, once uh, others have died. I think there can be three, three on screen at the same time. Alright, uh, what what would you guys like to see me sprite after this one is finished? Just the next frame of this or uh, something else? So let me know and uh, I will consider it.
Super Saiyan Farmer. <laughs> Yeah, as long as we can just uh, talk a little bit like this, and things pretty much fine, I think. Well, I will play a little uh, hyperdrive. We'll see. Once this frame is finished, just do uh, have a little break from the spriting. Still not bored by then, then I will keep spriting. There's a few uh, Patreon rewards after sprites, and there's still some commissions open I have to take care of. Yeah, Crash Bandicoot. He will be OP. Very much, yeah. <laughs> That's right, he had a gun. Broly didn't have no gun. say it's clear who's the winner there. Broly won't have a chance. Uh, I don't know what this is supposed to be. Get rid of that. That's good enough for me. You're back! I didn't know you were out, so well, welcome back. Farmer is a full-fledged character. Would you guys want that? <laughs> I really don't know what moves we would give him. He never really did too much. <laughs> Master Roshi, yeah, sure. He would be amazing. With his uh, growing ability, flexing those uh, muscles. And all his martial arts skills. Yeah, it, it would be awesome. Launch! Yeah, she looks, uh, she looks really nice. I hope he can continue working on her. Maybe uh, he can just uh, switch between, like I'm kind of doing with uh, Bulma. I'm not still not wor really working on her too seriously. She's not a really priority.
Yeah, yeah, he had a bunch of stuff. The Boncho fan, which we never got to see. Because <laughs> uh, he spilled coffee on it or something. The true that. Well, yeah, that electricity move is not really a new move. He did that way back in Dragon Ball. Yeah, Tien already has the Kikoho spam. It's not cinematic, it's just an in-game move. We're still going to tweak that though. It does really drain his life at the moment. And yeah, it should. Otherwise it's a little too good of a move. Because basically, uh, once you get the opponent on the first Kikoho, you could just spam the button. As long as you have energy, I mean uh, power bar, you can just keep spamming them. And they won't be able to break free or get out. Which is really cool, but it's a bit cheap. Yeah, I'm going to play a little bit of Hyper once the spring is done. Jan is so cool. I really like playing as him, even though he's still unfinished. Yeah, I thought one was cool. Mr. Flamboyant. Ace. Just like uh, Lee Cho Lan from Tekken. Just a little bit feminine, but uh, still very much about. Uh, the ladies. Actually, I don't know about, about that. In terms of the uh, level. Seems like a ladies' man to me.
Yeah. Just a shoes. There we go. This one. Left. Yep, title T. I love it. This is a little bit funky. Alright. Get my right hand that means. Yeah, that's going to look fine. The arm gets a little. Well, that's passable for me. Alright. Put it in the sheet. Where did it go? There. Don't need that anymore. Like this nicely. It's one more frame there than this one. Zip, zip, zip. Uh, 94 stones. Yeah, he did a remix. And another guy who did it first was a uh, reshot EB. Both are really cool. Ivy Metal uh, mixes. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm pretty bored at the moment in terms of spreading, so let's play a little Happy Rank Ball Z. Um, yeah, first let me show off the the Gogeta palette for good things should be one of his defaults Hyper. yeah I kinda messed up here, I don't know why it's uh, not positioned right but that's not really a concern Well, that's obviously uh, another pelt. I don't know on which button it is, really. Uh, someone can probably tell me what pellet this is. From Dragon Ball Heroes or something? Or uh, Xenoverse? Time Traveler? Future Goat Tanks, uh, yeah. Oh, the other one. Yeah, yeah Goat Tanks is still uh, closed. That's it. That's a Gogeta pilot. Round one, fight. Um, yeah, I kind of remembered that. There you got your uh, good good you shoot out. Got a lot of uh, air blasts. Go 
Why can't I do a super? Is it that laggy? Yeah, good thing he talk shit all the time. <laughs> I think he should do. Let's go with my boy Chen. Same pellets as a uh, template pellet. Round one. Which is still a one. kind of a special pellet. <laughs> a reference, I mean. My three two journals. See you next time. Ooh, that was a nice little uh, dodge. Nice one, Chad. Too. That's how you do it. Yeah, it's pretty laggy, I see. Yeah, it's not too bad. Maybe I could change the settings, like you say. <laughs> yeah, it was paused, but later. But yeah, I don't, I don't think it's too bad to like just a little tiny bit. Maybe it should be more flat to the ground. Be. Oh, yeah. yeah, I think we can make that look yeah, better. Sir. Another Gohan. Yeah, you can uh, input Chaozu's moves while you're getting hit, so I think that will be useful. Haha, <laughs> got you there. Yeah, I'm dropping that combo now because of the lag. The, that's a telekinesis move for Chaozu, but it's not. It's unfinished at the moment. It doesn't really work at all. Well. It doesn't work at all. Really. Chaozu's 
Greater than four what? What does that mean? in the balls. Yeah, that's... No, I'm, it's, ugh, I don't like it. It's a little laggy. I've had enough of that. What's the... what? <laughs> Is it something I can change in uh, settings? Yeah, let me know about that. I would like to get rid of that lag. It's a bit annoying. Oh, it's a prank. Damn you. <laughs> Alright, let's just uh, continue with this then. Where's the tunes? What are you talking about, man? That will uh, get us a copyright strike for sure, including Seinfeld episodes. Well, I don't know, it would still be a mutant character, technically, I guess. Oh yeah, the story mode. Um, yeah, we've talked about that a little bit, but it's not really a priority. You'd much rather just work on new characters and stuff. And we are mostly kind of basing it on uh, player versus player. So don't, those wouldn't be playing story mode anyway.
Yeah, maybe we'll do at least uh, a nice ending. Just a one big image uh, with some text. No promises though. Which uh, Super Mario do you mean? This one, right? Yeah, that's the one. Yeah, well, story mode, we wouldn't really go through a saga. We would just have little uh, character based condensed stories. Just something that follows the character, not especially the. not, not really the story. Because we, I don't think we really have a, a specific roster enough to replicate. I mean, to replicate the Blue Saga or Cell Saga. <coughs> and that's. I guess that's a problem with doing story mode. If, uh, if we do new characters, then we might have to change all those endings as well. Based on those new characters. <coughs> Yeah, that's probably what we would uh, do, yeah, probably. Something like Shin Budokai. Yeah, characters would have, would have their own, their own sort of stories. Sorry if I'm uh, talking a bit uh, weird. I keep tripping over my tongue. I haven't even had my shower yet. I really went pretty much straight out of bed onto the computer to stream, because I wanted to get here as early as I could. First I wanted to stream a little uh, last night, but I was just too tired. Because yesterday I, I also worked, I had to get out of bed at uh, 3.30. So by that time, when it was 10 o'clock at night, it was already uh, I was already awake for uh, 11 hours or something? No, pretty long at least. The only time I could 
can really stream in the at night would be I guess Sunday because I'm free uh, yeah I'm free all day Sunday and Monday so uh, I don't think I'll be as tired at that point and I'm not going to start uh, drinking loads of coffee that just doesn't sit well with my stomach Pretty much what if, what if stories, yeah. Yeah, they would include as little other characters as possible in their endings. Because then it wouldn't matter if we add more characters. If they got a little uh, condensed story. Yeah, again, it's not, just not really our uh, priority. Yeah, for Goku, well, you would kinda need the uh, get boo. If you want to rep replicate the story a little bit, you would have to be get boo. And sell, which we don't have either. There we go. This one should be finished. Don't like that. Just a little bit stuff. Yeah. Yeah, we're getting there. Right, we're uh, on Discord, most of us. Uh, yeah, it's, these arm muscles get pretty wonky. This, these damn triceps again. Here, changing all around. I'll have to fix that. Chips. That's what's missing. Yeah. 
Yeah, do this, something like that. Alright, let's fix some stuff on the arm. Just have to copy that part. Alright, is uh, anyone getting ready to uh, go to bed or leave or something like that? I don't know if I'll be streaming much longer. Bizarre Hermit, yeah, if you need to work they should uh, get a little bit of rest. Hey, I'm not getting sleep, I just woke up. But yeah, have a good rest and a good day at work tomorrow. And thanks for being here, man. See ya. this run finished because he still uh, slides around the stage right now. Looks kinda weird. Alright, new set of legs. Leggies. His walk is not coded yet, it's not, like, not even drawn yet. Yeah, <laughs> that should be one of the first things you draw for a character, but I don't like it. But uh, Daddy59 should be drawing outlines for me, for his walk animation. And when he has, I will most likely work on them. Star super rad guy. Just uh, the single sprite, I hope, right? Yeah, people haven't really donated yet while I'm on the stream. Somebody really has to. Now we can see the cool little uh, notification. I didn't have it set up yet when I was donated. Two times. Pretty much when. When I started, yeah, the first stream, stream, I think, yeah.
Yeah, you can't commission without Patreon. <clears throat> then just, uh, well, yeah, I'm actually kind of trying to get away from uh, doing commissions because that just eats away time from working on Dragon Ball Z. Uh, Patreon commissions, uh, rewards, I mean, they do also take up some time, but I, yeah, I think those are worth it. Because those are monthly donations, and I do want to make those people happy. So, uh, sprites will be in order for them. single sprite will be eleven dollars for a uh, <laughs> monthly backing. One dollar one dollar doesn't get you any rewards. Well except having uh, access to the feed of course. Might be some uh, goodies on there that I don't post anywhere else. Come on guys, just one Lousy dollar per month. Can't do it. And uh, uh, yeah, donate without uh, a single donation you can do via Streamlabs. And then you will get a little notification here. A commission without Patreon you can do. But uh, I pr prefer not to do them. I already have a, a couple of commissions I'm um, kind of slacking off on. I really would like to stop doing commissions, so I'll have, I will have more time to work on the Happy Dream Z. which everyone uh, is looking forward to the most, I would say. Sixteen dollars, yeah, that uh, gets you two sprites. My latest Patreon is actually uh, Barker, the the guy spreading uh, Super Boo. Well, uh, not the latest. Uh, it was a one new guy, just a one dollar one dollar guy. Mario and Hyper Dragon Ball Z style, yeah, that would <laughs> would be funny, but I can't promise if we'll uh, take that on. Yeah, the only the only way we could uh, do a full character commission like that would be uh, if there was no deadline attached, which I don't think a lot of uh, commissioners would agree on. I mean, it could take up a year or more because I wouldn't want to work on it full time I would very much like to be able to work on my own projects and just work on the commission character on and off just whenever I have a little free time so yeah I don't think a lot of paying customers as I would say uh, would agree with that <laughs> that it will take a year. <laughs> yeah, the idea is always nice. A Super Mario in the Hyper Dragon Ball Z style, that would be pretty funny. <laughs> but yeah, maybe the novelty will uh, will wear off pretty soon. I don't think a lot of people will uh, make sense out of it. Like, what the hell is Mario doing here? But yeah, still, I think we we would be able to make a really legit fun character out of it. He does have uh, plenty of moves to to use. Uh, like, 
really a, a lot of references we can put in there as well. Super Mario Z2. Yeah, not a lot of people like Bob, but he, he kind of sucks, to be honest. He can be fun to play against, but he's really hard to, to use. And obviously nobody, nobody's going to use Bobbity in a tournament or anything like that. He's just... <coughs> he's not really built for that. He has a lot of traps and stuff, but I don't think he would be able to keep up with some, someone like Vegeta or Goku. He would get trashed pretty badly. Big bush, big bush. Oh yeah, that part, Goku vs Cell, ending with uh, the warp, Kamehameha, Ooh. that's so badass. That fight's really well animated, that's my favorite animator from uh, Dragon Ball Z, by far. <coughs> it's too bad he kinda, the last episode he did was one of uh, Super Saiyan 2, Goku vs Kid Buu. That was really nice as well. But sadly, that was the last episode he worked on. That guy. I think he moved on to a lot of Pokemon stuff after that. Which is, uh, you know, fair enough. But I would love if he did uh, the final episode. I mean, the. Spirit Bomb versus Kid Buu. That same animator. any of Kai. I'm not sure if I even really want to. No, I never really sit down for a few hours and just watch stuff. I'm, al I'm always busy. Either spreading or, you know, when I do uh, have time off. I'm just eating my lunch or something. I'm always busy. The 
home for infinite losers. We can't say hell on TV. It's a kid's show. <laughs> that was kind of lame. Infinite losers. <laughs> That's kind of funny if you look back at it. Uh, that looks kind of similar, actually. Maybe I traced the wrong frame. I don't think so, though. I'm not going to have the same mistake again to the messed up triceps. Well, then again, they were messed up to begin with. Just uh, soldier through. I gotta get this run cycle done. <laughs> I don't know what, what I'm doing here. Let's just, just get rid of that. Uh, 
that's fine by me. Still here, guys. I'm just uh, tuning out a little bit. I think I'll finish this frame and then uh, that'll be it for this stream. Hope you guys are enjoying yourself. Though. Just not uh, the most talkative guy. So luckily, uh, I can have my work speak for me, in a way. Yeah, just uh, change the color of the blood and then it's fine, everything's okay.
thanks, thanks, thanks. Yeah. The best Mugen game ever. Well, so far it is. Maybe uh, a new, new game will rise up and challenge us. But thanks a lot, man. I'm really glad everyone's uh, enjoying this game as much as they say they do. And now people can uh, see it in the making. These damn sprites, so many of them. So many frames, so many years lost. Like tears in the rain. Alright, his eyes are getting uh, poking out a little bit there. No, it, it has. His head gets squashed. So let's just copy that, put it in there. How long have we been working on this game? Well, uh, Goku was the first character, even though it wasn't really Hyper Dragon Ball Z at that time. It was just a single Mugen character release. But anyway, that was back in, uh, I think, November 2011. That's when it kind of st all started. Then the next character was uh, Vegeta, a year later. You know, it was just was our second character. We still didn't really plan to make it into a, a game like we have now today. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, only when I made that uh, that big uh, fake trailer on YouTube. That's when we started using the term Hyper Dragon Ball Z. That was in, uh, I believe, 2014. So, yeah, so let's say uh, Hyper is in development for about three, three years now. And, uh, still going strong so far. <coughs> Better than ever, actually. The team is still uh, has been expanded. We've got some real uh, talent on board now. <laughs> yeah. Time flies. Normally I would just cover it with hair, but gotta have the bald head. Ah, yeah man, I see. You've been a fan for a long time, man. That's good, that's good.
Yeah, I really don't remember too much of it either. Even though I've still been a fan, I haven't really rewatched the series. No, <laughs> I'm still slacking on uh, Super. I'm still about at least six episodes behind. Right, the shirt and then uh, pre yeah, I think I'm gonna be stopping this stream. It's been a long, long, long time. <laughs> two and a half hours right now, so should probably be quitting soon. Sergeant Frock? What's that? I've never heard of that. It doesn't have to be that fluid because uh, it's going to be moving forward anyway. Damn, I'm really doing that. Crap job here. That's what you get when that's what you get when you don't really have the nice uh, outlines to work with. Watching a, a movie of it, one of the anime movies. It's pretty hard for me. <laughs> I've only watched it in little chunks of 15 minutes. It's a bit uh, busy. <laughs> Still haven't finished it. But yeah, it is funny though, just a little, maybe a little bit too busy for me. I see, this is the problem. The second frame should be having this uh, shoulder blade thingy. Come on. Drawing on the wrong layer. Just have to 
copy that. Apply it here. Merge. Merge. Copy. Paste. Blip, blip, blip. No. Alright, now we're all caught up. And this frame is pretty much done now. So let's put it in as well. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, now just... No, no, that's the wrong spot, you can go there. And again, I can just copy this upper body, which I will. I use it here. And all that's left is uh, this lower body. Do I? Oh yeah, this is, it's not really blue lines, it's just uh, holes, holes in the sprites. <coughs> but that's going to be fixed now, since I'm gonna redraw the frame. Yeah, whatever, let's uh, do this last frame. It's just the legs, so it's not too hard. And then I'll be... Uh, Stopping streaming. I'll stop streaming for a while. Then I'll have a, a lunch and my shower. I don't really wake up until I have had my shower. And I'll have, I'll have to run finished. Coder, the programmer will be pleased. And then he still needs a, a run, a running attack. I've not really thought about it too much. I could do this gut punch. Oh no, I removed it. I guess I didn't save the sheet. Anyway, it would have been this one. But uh, yeah, I think it's too similar to Mr. Satan's running attack, which is pretty much the same thing, just uh, more like this. But yeah, both are a gut punch. I think that was the last uh, of the music. Let's put on a few more. There we go. Yeah. All right. Let's wrap this up. Big whoops, I saw something about big whoops. Auto mod. Don't know when that kicks in. This is only the second time I've seen it.
Does he have actually have those physics? Super Mario. Didn't really notice that any uh, any point. Maybe it's only the later moves. All right. Yeah, the latest one. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I see some nose physics. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> I like that. Where the hell am I? Get back up there. Oops, that's uh, just a little bit. Probably fine. Is it going to be running forward anyway? This uh, arm is really messy. What the hell? This is the problem.
Ah, I need to fix that up. Let's just uh, copy this entire arm. Paste it. Color coding, uh, no, not really, it's just making a palette. Yeah, that's, uh, that makes me a little happier. Maybe I'll edit it a little bit more. Otherwise I'm going to be annoyed by this. Where did you go? There. There. Yeah, makes a move for that. A looping animation, I, I always draw a little line over it in the sheet. So that loops. Uh, maybe I'll have to do a little more for the stopping animation, the run stop. But not right now. Oh, right. I moved to this part again with a split. Alright guys, that's it. I'm uh, pretty tired now from spreading. It's time for a little lunch and shower. And I'll probably be doing stuff in the afternoon, but uh, not, not streaming I think. Just some commission work I have to get rid of. But hey, I did uh, end up finishing this running animation. That's something. Alright, yo, thanks a lot guys for uh, staying with me for uh, this is two and a half hours, a little more. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. You wanna be a mod, I know. <laughs> Alright, see ya guys.